Good evening. My name is Mike Phillips, and I'm representing uh, Deputy David Wong this evening. Uh, David apologizes for not being here, but he's at work, and uh, he's newly hired on a job where he does not have any flex time to leave this evening. Uh, David's a 20-year veteran of the Sheriff's Deputy Association. Uh, he spent eight years as president of the Sheriff's Association. Uh, a lot of you know that uh, recently he was uh, fired from the Deputy Sheriff's Association by the Sheriff's Sheriff. So one of the reasons he's not here is because he is suing the Sheriff related to the firing. David has worked for the department for 20 years. Uh, he has three main things he'd like to do as Sheriff. Reduce recidivism. And he'd like to do that through a job training program by helping individuals incarcerated learn skills that they can translate and transfer out into our community and help small businesses. Things like graffiti abatement, things like cleaning the beaches, things like washing cars. Simple things that we, some people take for granted, but things are skills which, while someone's incarcerated and with union oversight, that they can participate in. The second most important thing David Wong wants to do for you as sheriff is establish a stronger community relations between deputies and children. Uh, his linchpin, his whole 20 years, his career has been working with underdeveloped youth, at-risk youth, and youth in general in this city. Black, brown, yellow, white, poor, rich. David Wong's been there for all the kids from the sunset to down here in the TL. David Wong's walked precincts. David Wong's gone to pick kids up from school and making sure they got home. The third thing David Wong wants to do for you as sheriff is make the department economically efficient. He feels that there's a lot of waste in the sheriff's department. There's a lot of people who get paid by the department and they don't do a lot. There's a lot of people who, there's a lot of programs in the department that don't have any purpose. Now, David, if he was here, we would tell you the same thing, that there are three very qualified individuals running for sheriff. Himself, Paul Miyamoto, and Chris Cunt. But as I said earlier, David was fired by the sheriff for an incident which basically any of you would say, you know, why would this man be fired after 20 years of working with the department? He was never late. Now I repeat myself, he works for the department for 20 years. He was never late. Never had any write-ups on it. The only two times David Wong has had any incidents as a deputy was four years ago when he ran for sheriff, and then all mysteriously, he was accused of stealing money. We've been to court two times and won those cases, and we've been for, before the Labor Relations Board two times and won that. So we've dealt with this slap suit four times with these people who have accused David of stealing money. David Wong is not a thief. He's never stolen any money in his life. And David Wong would never harm an, in, an inmate. This is all bullshit, excuse my language, but the department is corrupt from the top down, and David ran four years ago to try to adjust, and I, I know you guys don't want negativity, so I apologize again, but David's running because he's had enough of the same old, same old, back slapping, hand sliding, things that go on in that department. 900 people work there, and the things that go on, the morale, is as low as you could ever want to have your deputies have. They're not happy, they're frustrated, they're scared for their jobs. Is that the way you want people to go to, when, you know, when someone happens to be incarcerated, should the deputies be afraid to do their job? And that's the system that we live under currently, under the current sheriff. So, David Wong, he lived in the sunset for the last 30 years. He came here in 1976 from China. He's an army man, did army intelligence. Uh, he's done a lot of you know, community programs. You can go to our website, David Wong for Sheriff. He's a good man. Uh, we've got a few endorsements for a few organizations. We just started our campaign on Friday. We look forward and we'd like to thank your uh, PAC for your recommendation for David. And uh, we'll be out there, David will be out there knocking on your door and I'll be out there and the rest of the campaign will be out there asking for your support for David and also for Paul and for Chris. All right, have a nice night.